Selenium 4 allows us to open a new window and a new tab in the same session at the same time. After opening the window or tab, we have the ability to work in it without creating a new driver. In this video, we're going to look at the concept of opening a new window and a new tab. With previous versions of Selenium, we could use the robot class to simulate the keyboard and open a new tab by pressing Ctrl T, then switching focus to the tab after getting the window handle. Now we can perform those same steps with Selenium 4 using one line of code. We can use it for a window or a tab. Driver dot switch to dot new window window type dots window or tab dot get URL. You notice window and tab are written in green. Driver is used to control the browser. Switch to is a method that sends commands to a window. It switches focus between the windows. New window is a method that creates a new window or tab, then automatically switching focus to that new window or tab. Window type is an enum. Enum is short for enumeration, which is a list of constants that define a new data type. In this case, the constants are window and tab that instructs our program to open a new window or new tab. Window is the parameter for creating a new window. Tab is also a parameter, but it's used for creating a new tab. Last is the get URL method, which loads a new page in our browser. For our test script, we have a setup method to load an automation practice website, then get the title. I commented out the teardown method because I want the page to stay open after executing our test script. Let's start the test by writing at test public void test new window concept driver dot switch to dot new window window type dot and we see tab and window let me import our test annotation from test ng hover the new window method and the description states creates a new browser window and switches focus to that window for future commands of this driver to the new window. You know what? Let me read that again. <laughs> Creates a new browser window and switches the focus for future commands of this driver to the new window. In shorter words, it will open a new window, then switch focus to that window. We also see the parameters are type hint, which is a type of new browser window to be created. The type hint will be window or tab. Returns. This driver focus on the given window. When it says window, it's referring to window or tab. That's why I was able to write window type dot tab. One more point. Do you see how the return type is web driver? If we choose to, we can assign this statement to web driver with any name like new page. Let's run. We have two tabs and a blank tab is open with automatic focus in the new tab. The same outcome happens with the new window. Change tab to window, then run. And that's one of the reasons why I commented out the teardown method 
because Selenium executes so fast and I want the tab to stay open so we can look at it and the window to stay open. A blank page is open in a new window. For our test script, after the blank page, we're going to open the contact us page. Let me grab this URL and load a new page by writing new page dot git. At this point, and in the slide, I mentioned git, but we can also use the navigate method to open a new page. And I'm going to paste the contact us page. Also, print the page title. Sys out title driver dot get title. Let's run. Bingo. Let's go back to our IDE. Both titles are displayed in the console, my store and contact us, my store. Next, I will show you how to open, switch, work in the new tab then switch back focus to the parent tab. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Books available in paperback, ebook, and PDF. All Part 1 ebooks and PDF documents are free. Programming books for UFT. Programming books for Java. Here's the Selenium Automation Book. And TestNG. Subscribe to get notification of future videos. Don't forget to like, comment, and share.